Hi YouTube friends, well it's uh, March 27th, I can say winter is uh, officially over uh, even though there's snow still standing I think the uh, most of the winter uh, has to be um, over by now, I mean it's almost April but uh, I figured I'd give a little bit of a an update on how my uh, garage and box held over through the winter months and uh, you can see it's still standing and did quite well uh, structurally it's still sturdy uh, I don't see any changes over the winter at all uh, since when I initially installed it there are no tears in the fabric there's no leaks inside of it the only thing I think that I need to do is to tighten up the straps a little bit and that's it I through the winter, winter months there was times when uh, snow accumulated on the roof um, up to a foot deep and uh, there I haven't been out here that much uh, clearing it maybe only a couple of times and still it, it was fine so I wouldn't uh, I give this uh, I, I actually can I give this a 10 out of 10 I don't see any reason why this can't uh, be included in, uh, in as a, a shelter for a lot of uh, these storage or for your uh, garden items or tractors or whatever but I'll uh, take a walk around it yeah it's uh, I hope you can get a good look at it now mind you um, I am it has been pretty much protected by that building next to it, the pole barn. And I think that had a lot to do with it. I think in an open area uh, there might have been more issues. So uh, my only suggestion would be to uh, to make sure it's, it's you pick a good area when you uh, if you buy one of these and install it. And they they went up a little bit in price but I think you can still get them at a good price. I don't think you can get them at $159.99 like I did. You might be able to uh, from Harbor Freight. But uh, yeah, that's uh, that's basically it. Uh, so uh, just wanted to give you an update. Uh, thanks for your comments and subscriptions. And uh, talk to you later.